Anyone up for some 2D top-down action adventure game reminiscent to the old Legend of Zelda titles? Well, girls and boys, do I have a title I wish to showcase to all of you today. I am Bianca and I am here to give a little bit of spotlight to a Kickstarter project where you explore a mysterious world where an equally mysterious disease has taken root and the dead find no peace. Spindle. Now, before we begin, let me just give a massive shout out to Moritz Schultz. I hope I didn't butcher your name's pronunciation for telling me about this title. Let me also just state that this is in no way sponsored and that this video is just meant for me to share my thoughts and put a spotlight on this indie title and promote it and maybe give the campaign a little bit of a push. This is a Kickstarter campaign that promises classic puzzle dungeons, tricky bosses, an exciting story with interesting characters and secrets, all packed in a 10 to 12 hour long adventure. The campaign, currently sitting at $48,697 of its $64,695 goal, already has 1,306 backers and at the time of this recording only four days left to reach that goal. Now I've tried out the demo myself which is available in the Kickstarter page and you can choose whether to play it via your web browser or downloading it through Steam and I've got to say I am intrigued. In the demo which is quite it's honestly much too short for my liking, we're suddenly thrust into following the bidding of a pig who tells us that we're in this predicament because we touch the spindle. We are then tasked to find a way to a cemetery where, as typical of the genre, we have to find the key by navigating through the dungeon's puzzles and fight the boss. At the end of it revealing an interesting twist, which I'm not going to spoil just just in case you guys want to give this demo a whirl. Suffice to say, I liked what I saw and enjoyed what I played, despite again it being such a short experience. The controls, based from the demo, are easy enough. Even though it uses the keyboard, which you all know by now, I'm not really used to, the aesthetics, the pixel graphics, the music, and the effects really harken back back to the feel of the NES and SNES era games, albeit with a much cleaner and fluid frame rate and crisper color, almost like the Game Boy Advance adventure games and a very well made music to accompany it. In all honesty, now that I think about it, this game reminded me a bit of how it was with Moonlighter, another indie game that I really enjoyed playing and one we did a let's play of here in this channel. Now the Kickstarter page promises a lot of gameplay mechanics, from unique dungeons with their own quirks, being able to control the pig, a vast world divided into five regions with their own special story, mini games and side quests, not not to mention the aforementioned story, which is what I am most intrigued by. I really hope that this action adventure featuring death and a pig would get completely backed, as this is a title I would most certainly want to play fully and share with you all here in this channel. If you guys are interested in helping it reach its goal, you can head on over to Spindle Kickstarter page, the link of which is in the description down below. As I've said before, this video is not sponsored in any way. 
Heck, the devs, let's game dev, don't even know about me or about this video. Maybe up until I tag them when this is all published. I simply and truly just want to give this title and the people behind it what support I can give. I really want to, in my own little way, support indie video games and developers, especially when their title is as promising as this one. But anyways, that's all the time we have for today. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, you guys know the wait, 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 hold up. Before we actually say goodbye for today, let me just give a massive congratulations to our giveaway winner, Richie, who commented on our Twitter post. You, sir, won the code. Be sure to contact me to claim it. And yeah, I think that's about it for today. Again, thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, you guys know the drill. Dream on, fly on. Bye-bye for now. Keep safe, everyone. Different things for you.